So we are back again in the passageway. Uh, sorry, Sandeep, I'm going to trouble you again. Uh, because the previously I messed up. I forgot to switch on to video mode. I did it in time lapse mode. So we sh we'll give you a short clip of that one. Blah 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 blah. Well, that's what we kept doing about, and it was as good as that because the audio didn't get recorded. So passageway, short short details back again. All right, so we are in the starboard side passageway of uh, Wheel and Carrier, and uh, we are uh, looking out through some lights. Same as explained earlier, there are a few fire light, spray light, bunker light, steam light. So we are going through here all here as well. So let's see what where it takes. Okay, to get familiar with what this passageway is, let's take a look into this general arrangement plan. You can see the cross section of the vessel right here. So the passageway, what I'm talking about, is in this, this slot. Can you see this slot here? It's in this slot. This is your cargo tank. It's at the top corners of your cargo tank, running right from the aft end of the vessel till almost the forward end of the vessel. So this is the general arrangement plan. You enter from the passageway from this door right here. You can walk all the way and reach here. Once you reach the forward here, there's another door. You can get off this ladder and you reach the forecastle deck. The importance of this passageway is it carries all the cables, carries a couple of pipes. And in case of bad weather, you can go forward through this passageway to check your anchor, to check your forward store, and also to check the forward pump room if it's there. The top view of the vessel, so again, it runs from this side and this side along the vessel right up to the forward. One more time. These two sections, port side and the starboard side passageways are here. Running from this end to here. That's all we see. First, what we can see right now, here we can see a deck fire line. The fire line that runs from the port and starboard side of the ship. The isolation valves for the fire line are here. We have a deck air valve, uh, water, water hydrants that, are, that if we need fresh water for washing or air for any maintenance is here. The uh, isolation valves, these, these uh, insulation clad pipelines are the steam pipes or they could be, oh yes, sorry, these are the glycol water uh, pipes which are clad. And uh, yes, let's look at the passageway. The passageway has a lot of these electrical cablings. Otherwise on other ships, they run through ducts on the ship. Now we are passing under the compressor room. That's why it's that loud and that's why I'm, I'm shouting as well. We are not here on an entertainment tour in this passageway. So make sure you look and complete all your inspections at one go. You need to look at all the pipelines, look at the electrical cables, these electrical cabinets, ensure they are tight. All the lights in this passageway are working and fire hydrants, fire extinguishers. Oh, here. Here's the bunker line isolating. It's the first time Sandeep and me are coming in this passage. So that's what we were looking for, the bunker line isolation valve that's just down under this platform, a couple of steps. Follow us, let's go. Yeah, let's go down. I have adjusted the color tone in this video so it looks a little brighter. Anyway, let's speed up the video. We don't have anything much to see here. Just a few pipes, bunker pipes that's running through. The insulated one is the fuel one, the other one's the diesel. We are done and let's bounce up the stairs. Once we're done, I need to shut that hatch so that nobody falls and trips over. And let's go back out. We are done with the passageway inspection. So that's something new for me. And I hope it's something new for most of you guys. Remember, this is also an enclosed space. So make sure your permits are filled up. Your checklists have gone through. You know what to do. You've gone through a risk assessment. You're in a closed loop communication with the bridge and you have your personal gas meter on. Okay, so out of the passageway on the starboard yeah, just getting out of the starboard side passageway. All done, thanks.